Hello, my name is Kendrick Celestine. I'm going to talk about the uh, biography per uh, individual. I don't know if you never heard about her, but I want to share her story. And I'm going to put my version, my perspective about her. Her name is uh, Joyce Carol Vince. Uh, Joyce was actually born October 19, uh, 1965. And it was called Hammersmith, uh, London, England. So... She was the daughter of an African father and an Indian mother. She was the youngest of all her four sisters. Uh, both her parents, well, her mother was deceased when she was very young. So her father pretty much collected her. And I know one day she was taken up. Well, during she attended school, she dropped out around 16. Yeah, I remember she worked at... Um, Worked at pretty much at a uh, the city of London. So she worked at called the Music Records. Uh, when I find really, um, I remember she worked a lot of things. She had friends, family. So she really would meant something to her. But but a lot of times on a level, but everything about her was just off the chart. I remember she moved to Greenwood, London, of the district. I remember she was there. I remember she was buying some shopping stuff. But at the time, I remember about this woman who was so interesting, like, and this one, Mike's, um, her story really packed me because, because she loved music, she loved the drama, but I remember she was in an abuse relationship, and she had a domestic partner who used to beat her all the time, and I remember one day, she, uh, resigned from out of her job since, like, 2001, and I remember she went to the shed, and I remember, uh, called a abuse uh, domestic abuse shatter shelter and I know one day she stood in Greenwald for about two years and after that I just remember during Christmas she died of an asthma attack um, around December 2003 and around she was wrapped around presents every day she was laying on the couch she de decomposed but she'd been gone for about two and a half years and they discovered her on January 25th 2006 that was pretty much on my birthday. That I was like 15 during that time. Um, when they discovered her body with nothing but bones. And I remember in 2014, they made a case. Um, they made, in 2011, they made a movie about uh, the dreams of life. About this woman named Carol, jo uh, Joyce Carol Fence. And um, what kind of made me um, so impact me about her story. But one thing would bother me, nobody noticed her for about two and a half years. And really bother me about her because like I like, know it really like bothered her to take the time, like notice or ask her, um, see what's going on. Regardless, even though for me, I could even though I don't even know this woman, like how I know about this woman, I discovered this woman about ten years ago. So and this is pretty much the twenty years uh Joyce Carol Vince she's been gone for a long time. And I wanted to make a good memory of her, you know, just from my perspective, my version of it. And I like this woman because she just, something about her just packed me. And I don't know what it was, but she really packed me. But, and I just feel like I wanted to share some of her night story. I don't know if you guys, you know, you guys ever heard about her, but this woman, her name is Joyce Vance Carroll. I wanted to acknowledge her work, the story about how she lived. Because, like, even in the one day, what bothered me the most, she cut out. She cut off like friends, family members, everyone. Like nobody even knows she was gone. That's the really what bothers me most because like no one ever bothered like check because even though they have family members who did who called the Texas, they will find her. None of it, but it took two years, two years, and this would bother me. Like no one wouldn't even know. Like that's the same for me. Imagine I could be dead for two years and no one don't even know I was gone. That's the scary thing. And um. But yeah, I'm just kind of like bothered because regardless, I call a lot of people in my life sometimes and I just have to check on others and I have to really think about them all the time. But it's like, I just have to have it, just have that care to at least think about it. Regardless if I know I was rejected a lot, but I want people just to know, hey, like, come on, you ain't gonna get nobody else. And regardless or not, I look at like, it's all you got, but you gotta have those who are there for you. But, but at the same time, but I wanted to share a story about this woman. Her name is Joyce 
um, Carol Vince. That's her name. Yeah, so I found her. She was an interesting individual. So she was an English African Indian woman. So, and um, she was very gorgeous, beautiful woman, very beautiful. She only lived to be 38. And I just wanted to share the knowledge, you guys. You guys ever heard of her? It's called Joyce Carol Fence. So, uh, I'll give you a biography of history, so I'll send a link down below. Check out whatever you guys, be on your own free time, whatever. But I just want to acknowledge her. Her name is Joyce Fence Carol. So anyway, this is the title, Joyce Fence Carol. All right. Like, dislike, comment on below. See what you guys think of it. Um... I will continue making more later in the future. I hope folks have a wonderful good morning, afternoon, evening, whoever, wherever part of the world you're at. Um, hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day and your good night. All right. And this is Kendrick Celestine. And I'm out.